run an MSc in public health here and its focus is on community healthcare, looking at the health, health of populations as opposed to individual people. I learned that public health is a highly complex um, issue. A lot of the times people are focused on public health as a problem of behaviour when in fact um, the problem is far more complex than that. So you've got to think about everything from uh, how the system works, what the community's like, what the social and physical environment's like, and then what the politicians are doing. So when we're talking about communicable diseases, we could talk about diseases right across the world, um, malaria, smallpox, polio, tuberculosis. When we're talking about non-communicable diseases, which is one of our greatest threats, we're talking about issues to do with mental health, obesity, we're talking about issues to do with smoking use, alcohol use. But we also want to look at the social, environmental, economic issues that may impact upon people's choices. One of the things that we're really interested in is the, is the equality of outcome. You're a lot taller than me. We both go to a, a concert. Now we've paid the same amount of money, we have the equality of opportunity to go and listen to this gig we're really interested in. We're halfway back in the crowd. I can't see a thing, because I'm only five foot five. And you're fine. So although we have equality of opportunity, we don't have the equality of outcome. And how will we fix that? I'd get a box to stand on. That what that shifts is what you do for people. So you don't treat everybody the same. You, you treat them differentially based on what they need to get the same kind of outcome. So there are four different tracks on the MSC in public health. A general track, a prevention track, um, a communicable diseases track and a leadership track. I think one of the highlights from, from my perspective as a lecturer and probably from the students' perspective as well is that you get such a wide range of people from lots of different backgrounds and we all learn from each other. I'm from America and a lot of my peers aren't from the UK, they're actually from abroad and so they come with various backgrounds and different health systems. Bringing their own experiences to discussions, um, opening up a whole new world to me that I really didn't know about. And it's those critical discussions that we spend a lot of time analysing and exploring within our own um, classes which are probably run more like workshops actually and are very interactive and group based. We have um time that is shared between listening to someone giving a very interesting talk. After that we spend maybe double that time actually discussing about it. But what really hooked me was I really liked studying many different things such as for example you look at history, um, sociology as well. Um, our lecturers have been brilliant. Um, it's made me go out and want to read more, learn more. They're not, they're not just our students, they are our in a sense junior colleagues who are joining us and the staff actually have time to talk to you and they do care about what you're doing and where you're going.